welcome back to the part three of the Dishonor series, guys. So last we checked off was uh, I just got back from a mission where I marked the person who put me in the prison, and we're gonna continue and again try to be as stealthy as possible. I don't know if that's gonna work. Oof! But for now, let's continue the story. Hello, Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night, moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper, the poor bastard. There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. Nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating, just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I tend a servant down there, but they die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. Uh, let's open the hatch and start this thingy. Uh, flip. Uh, I mean, last time I checked, it doesn't matter if you kill these guys, but I'll try and. Uh, just knock them out and put them to sleep. Hopefully that's gonna work out. There we go. Fall asleep! Thank you. A letter? I'll leave it for you guys to read, so... Let's pick this thing up, and I think, yep, there's another one over here. There we go, now. Uh, I think there's nothing over here, but let me check just in case. Okay. Let's go. Back the way we came, I think. Ooh, I see a shiny. Okay. Ah, uh, come on. Stairs. Work. A branch. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I think that's it for this part. Uh, I think you can. Ooh. Oh, you can open this. Oh, I never know that. I never knew that. Huh. Ooh, fishy. Run. Fishes can actually harm you, so if you guys are playing through this, be careful. Copper wire, oh uh, yeah. Can I get out there? I mean, I can teleport, but is it worth it? There we go. Oh, you went down there in the sewers? Hi there. I thought I heard a weeper in there earlier. Probably the bravest man I've ever met. Oh, Overseer thank you. Martin has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. Do they now? Okay. I'm guessing a side quest. I know the Golden Cat. Not as a patron, mind you. I designed some specialized devices for them. I kept the blueprints. If anyone is curious don't i brought you tea as a courtesy to a colleague i won't make that one. there you go a letter i'm sorry i only thought never mind what i thought thank you for the tea i have to get back to the admiral he has news for me mm. Wait. 
blood from the eyes. Well, that doesn't sound spooky at all. Corvo, my friend. Do you need ammunition or weaponry? Would you like me to craft something for you? Yeah, I might need some ammo. And uh, this thingy. And this thingy. There we go. Perfect. Let's continue. Hopefully. Open. Do, do, do. Hi, guys. Corvo. I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before and perhaps again someday soon. I owe you thanks for my rescue. Indeed. You've given us a glimmer of hope, Corvo. Because we've gotten what we've wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily Caldwood is being held. The Golden Cat, of all places. A bathhouse for aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. The twins, Morgan and Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily, but they have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. Yes, the Pendletons have to die. But most importantly, Emily must be brought here safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. Pendleton's waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. Well, let's talk to the Pendleton guy. Hi there. Corvo, a moment if I may. You sure Corvo. may. I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. It's true, as you may have heard. Cruel beyond words. Further, my brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent. And as long as they are in Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that not every family evicted in quarantine for having the plague actually has the plague. I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the city watch, so it'll be dangerous. Now go. Please do it before I change my mind. Well, off we go. Time to go to my buddy Samuel. I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. All right, let's go. Get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. Okay. Well, time to go. And try and be selfie again. Oh, so that's a thing. 
Okay. So kill less and you'll have less rats to deal with. Hmm. Interesting. That was interesting. Well, I get I got spiked. That'll teach me to not go up fences. I think I can be not stealthy. Hey, yeah. You're just the man I was looking for. Slackjaw's wanting to talk to you. Okay. Sure. That him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey, we got a message for you from Slackjaw. He wants to talk. At the distillery. Well, let's go to the distillery. Shall we? No need to be stealthy here, I guess. Because the guy called me. Personally. You just need a bit. Ain't you heard? Slackjaw keeps the good stuff for himself. The rest of us get one part of this. Now, how to get to him? That is the question. Oh, yeah, okay. Now I remember. Hi. My men were right. You do look like a man out for murder. <coughs> Way I figure it, there ain't nobody worth killing round here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See, slack your nose. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while, not sure why. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cat tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there, dressed like that, and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe I got a better way to take care of them, too. If you're doing something for me first, understand? Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. You do that for me and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Well... That's gonna be fun. <coughs> oh, there's a bomb charm there. Now, where is that? There's a way. <coughs> oh. Really? Oh my god, so close but yet so far. Never mind. Ugh, I hate that part but let's go to Glovani's place That 
that settles that. Oh, I can't carry more ammo of this no type. Time okay. To well, we got somebody about. Ooh, nice. What did they get? What did they get? Uh, this one. Enemies have a slight chance to miss with guns. Mm, it's gonna help, but not much. Increased. Uh, what should they go for? I think I'm gonna go with... Oof. I might save up for the vent time thingy. That might come in handy at some point. Food? Yeah, let's maybe not fudge. Come on, do I need, really need to be pixel perfect? Try this. <laughs> well, the start wasn't that good because of those. Ninjas, the ninja guys, but or no, not a big deal. Maybe you can go up later and take a look after the mother two are gone. I wonder where that guy went. Oh, oh there he is. Now I need 
need to know. Okay, there is a rune there. And we need to go up here. What do you think? I think he's dead, right? I know that. I mean, do we have suspects? Suspects? Dies. Suspects? We ain't gonna waste time solving who killed him. Personally, I'd buy who did it a drink. But what are you gonna put on your report? I'm gonna say we found one of Slackjaw's men inside, all dead and bloody, and that you are a stinking idiot. <laughs> Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe so. I should be okay here. I wasn't safe there, but... Yeah... I'm, I've been to, the to this house before, so... Whoops! to go back to the slack jaw guy okay I think this is the exit That's gonna help us with the mission we are on. So, uh, seven. Perfect. <laughs> okay. Hey, 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 wait a bit. What? What just occurred to me? How come it's always me who pay for the whiskeys? Shush up your mouth. You know I can't work out the right number of coins. You're always the new guy. So, the new guys always pay drinks. I think. for my missing guy. Let's have a listen. Yes. Blackjaw, it's me, Crowley. I'm making this in case I don't make it back. He was right. There is someone once you did. Wants to take over the distillery and the whole Bottle Street gang. And you'll never believe who it is, neither. At first, I did. That's why it's taken me so long. I wanted to be sure, and... What's that? No! No! Ah! So Kral is dead. Too bad. He was one of my best men. Still, you and me had a deal, and Slackjaw never goes back on a deal. Take this key. It ain't for the golden cat, no. This key's for the captain's chair. A hotel abandoned since the plague gutted this part of town. Take the stairs to the top. You can use the roof to get into the Golden Cat Brother. See that? 
Slackjaw keeps a bargain. Just as good as the men who run the city. Maybe a little better. You think about that. Now maybe we can help each other out again. I could get rid of the Pendletons for you. Quiet-like and without killing them. But you gotta do something for me in return. The cat's having a big hey. reopening tonight. Lot of money clients. Including an arts dealer named of Bunting. He's got particular tastes, or so I've been told by some of the ladies. Got some pretty fancy stuff locked away at his place. And the only thing preventing me from nabbing all that loot is the combination to his safe. Of course, the Pendletons have been camped out there for months too, not sure why. So that means a lot of the city watch and other soldier types. Bring me that combination, my masked friend, and then I take care of the Pendleton brothers. Just like that. You ain't never even gonna touch them. And I promise, I won't kill them, and no one will ever see them again. Now if that ain't a deal, Slackjaw don't know what is. Okay, I'm healed. Ooh, a book. Bullet. Okay. Take this stick. Ooh, a grenade. Nope. I'm going stealthy. Oh, I'm trying to go stealthy. Empty bottle, food. How do I? Really? Now I'm out of arrows. Oh my god! How could? How can I refill my arrows? That's gonna help. Food. Talk. Now it's gonna be interesting because I'm out of uh, slip darts. So, it's gonna be fun. Get there. This way. Attention, Dunwall citizens. This district is now under a mandatory compliance will be strictly enforced. 
<sighs> that was close. Ooh, a bone charm. Now, what is this one? Eh. I'm not killing that much. Ow, ow. Rats. Well, time to go to a brothel, I guess. Not sure how good that is, but we'll see. Pathways, let's go. If I can get that rune for free, that is the question. Do you see anyone in? No, I don't. That was close. Oof, I almost died there. Ooh, that was stressful. Art dealer. Yes. I'll take care of him later. But for now, I need to go this way. I've lost track of him. Morgan's in the steam room downstairs. Nice. Just safe in there. Because I've heard rumors. If one of them gets hurt, I'll lose my job. Oh, that's just the girls talking. It's nothing. Pressure builds up in the pipes, and, well, it almost never happens. I'll make sure they never mention it again. Anyhow. Don't they needed to get a key? Uh, never mind. You're wearing a mask to sneak around, aren't you? They, they, they told me you were head chopped off and in the prison dead, like, like mother. That seems like a long time ago. But you're not dead. Now we can leave. I have a plan. I almost got away twice. There's a special door to come and go for special people, and I'll show you. And if anyone tries to stop us, you can fight them. This way. Piece of trash, if you ask me. It's 
locked. Okay. She caught me trying to get away. Now Nine night. Dead. Ooh. Oh, there was a room there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. New plan. Go this way. Nope. Not the bomb. That's what I need. The room that's right there. Bye. You saw nothing. Okay. Uh, what do we want to do? I want to take care of the art dealer Pendletons are here. You're supposed to be on duty. Come on. You're supposed to be on guard. You'll get dismissed for sure. I can't believe this. You said you weren't even drunk. Wake up. for 20 minutes. Your footsteps sound a little loud. Have you... Oh, 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 that's good. I deserve that one. Shall I tell you why? The Pendletons are here, right? I'll start with them. I cheated them. Robbed them of thousands. We never judge kings, guys. So just remember that one. Oh, you're ruthless. Don't hold back. I'll tell you everything. Pendleton's inheritance was worth hundreds of thousands at least. I told them it was junk. Ah! Ah! 
Retribution! Retribution! Ah, oh, that was perfect. But it's all I can take for tonight. Call my servants. We're done. Ah, we're done, I said. Retribution! Now let me out! Uh, let's not do that. What the? Who is this? What do you want? I uh, want the combination to the safe. The safe? Yes, of course. Yes. The combination is 696. Take anything you find. I think I felt my heart skip. Ooh, 69. Really? Whoops. I might have done something I shouldn't have. Which was have lead feet. Oh, I forgot that one. Oh my god, give me a sec. Ooh. That was close. Okay, I don't need that anymore. I needed this. I needed to get that. There we go. Now we can leave. Hopefully. Hi there, honey. Well, bye there. This place is on the river, so you must have come by boat. I'll wait for you near the boat. I will. You. Remember the way. Don't worry about me. Okay. She was about to say something, and then I. Accidentally cut her off, but I got her back. Nice. Onwards and forwards. Well, backwards. Oh. That's a bone charm. Exit is that way, right? Come on. Come to dinner now, that's right. Let's what did he get? Ah, uh, food heals slightly more. Hopefully, I won't need to use uh, the book. And some money. There you go, guys. Now, onwards. Okay, hopefully I didn't give my position away there, but still redistrict the golden cat. No, where did I need? I need to go this way actually.
yeah, this is the thing I needed, and that's why I got the, that code thingy. I forgot about that. Oh. So this is our awful lousy way to make coins. Poor bastard. Stuff can't be worth nothing. Can they? Not a chance. I think I remember having seen you training at my grandmother's place. She wasn't a nut job. Yeah, you probably can't even stop the job. That's what we need. The question is, how do we get them? <coughs> okay, got one. Nice. Now, how do I get the second one? This is how. <laughs> Let's go. Nighty night. There are things you can collect here, like this, or money. Now, the next one is up there, which is gonna be even more difficult. Come on, Stu, one more try. They wouldn't have such a strong door unless they kept some interesting things on its other side. I'm telling you, won't budge. Sorry dude, you didn't need to die, but you forced me. Sorry. Did you pick up this thingy? Okay, I did. Now, the combination was 6, 9, 6. Now, I heard something about this combination being different for everyone that plays, so it might not work for you guys, basically. Nice. Give me this. Give me this. Give me this. And this. And... And now we can leave. Poor dude, you didn't need to die, why did you... Oh my god. Dude, why? He died with no purpose whatsoever. Uh, poor people. Sometimes bad judgment is what's what's gonna doom you. Oh no. Can I? No, I can't. <gasps> Oof. I almost died there. Attention, citizens of Dunwall. Okay, I can go this way. In this area. Failure to comply. And we'll go to the 
distillery district which is right here hi guys I'm back okay time to not be stealthy at all I mean like I was stealthy early earlier That was an innocent kill, oh my god. Well, if there's anything innocent about killing. You brought me the numbers. I've been after this combination for months. If you ever need steady work, you come see me. Slackjaw knows a good man when he sees one. It's only natural that you'd be curious about what I intend to do with the Pendletons. See, the Pendletons got these rock mines. Have hundreds of souls working down there half a mile deep below ground. So I'm gonna shave their heads and cut out their tongues and put them in one of their own stinking mines. Then they're gonna see life from a different angle. So, shave their heads, cut their tongues out, and that's it? Yeah, sometimes killing some people is basically mercy, maybe, don't know, don't judge me, please, so off we go, back to Samuel. Samuel, buddy. Look out for the watch. They got no respect for laws. Oh my god. That didn't work. Okay. D, just in case. Oh! How? The <coughs> okay, I didn't expect that. citizens. Thaddeus Campbell, formerly High Overseer, is no longer a citizen of Dunwall. He now bears the Heretics brand, and by one of the oldest traditions of the Abbey of the Everyman, it is now a minor criminal offense to offer this man aid or housing. In this time of spiritual crisis, the Overseer... Both ready to go? Corvo, you must work wonders out there in the city tonight. I can't believe my old eyes. Yes, let's get Emily back. Overall chaos low, which is nice. Eh, I killed some people. One. That's a good thing. Uh, five out of five runes, which is nice. Three, two, two, nice, 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 nice. Let's go. So you did the business, did you, Corvo? I'm not one to speak against my betters, mind you, but if anybody ever deserved their fate, it was those Pendletons. What business are you talking about? Oh, I, uh, grown-up business, girl. I mean, your ladyship. Forgive me. It's okay. I heard a lot of grown-up business at the Golden Cat. Oh, 
I should concentrate on piloting this boat. <laughs> yeah, living in a brothel isn't really a good thing for uh what is this, 14 year old? 10 year old, something like that. Welcome back. Or welcome home. Emily. Young lady Emily, I'm Callista. I'll be caring for you and schooling you while you're with us. Pleased to meet you. As am I. Would you like to see your room in the tower? Can I see it? Yes, you may. You'll get to see it all. The entirety of the hound pits. Good. I think I'll like it here. I'll go with Callista, Corvo. I'll see you later. Take care. You do not fail to impress. Armed with a blade, you've changed the course of the city forever. And with the Pendleton twins gone, our own Lord Pendleton will assume their votes in Parliament. That's a in good thing. one night, you've done more than most men do in a lifetime. I need to speak to you soon. But for now, Lord Pendleton requests your attention. Lord Pendleton requests my attention. Lord Pendleton is over there. Let's try and get over there and fail miserably because it was the wrong way, but never mind. Corvo, the Loyalist Conspiracy thanks you for your work. I don't know if I can. My own brothers. We never believed that you killed the Empress. It made much more sense that the Royal Spy Master, now the Lord Regent, was behind it, aided by some of his key allies. We spent a lot of money and exposed ourselves to great risk in getting you out of prison. But we did it because we believe that you're the one that can make the difference. Oh, and Havelock's looking for you. Again, I just talked to him. Oh, come on. Havelock and Martin. Martin. All right, my friend. Martin's devised our next move. There's a footnote in Campbell's journal that tells us the Lord Regent's mistress sat for a portrait with Sokolov, the painter and royal physician. He'll be able to give us her name. Sokolov lives on Caldwin's Bridge about half the time, out over the river. The catch is that I'm afraid you've got to head out right away while Sokolov is at his apartment on the bridge. Samuel can get you close to the bridge, but you'll have to find Sokolov. Bring him back here intact, and it'll enable us to make our next move. I can't believe what you've done so far. Escaping from Coldly, taking down the High Overseer, recovering Emma. You make this old military man proud. That's it, then. Well, that bridge mission is gonna wait a little, because... That's gonna be our next part, basically. It's gonna take a lot, and hopefully, it's gonna be st as stealthy as this one. Well, more stealthy than this one. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Share your thoughts on my gameplay in the comments below, and I'll catch you next time. Take care, guys.